Trent Meissenheimer up here in Days Fork. I'm on a slope that has avalanched previously, maybe once or twice during this season. If you remember from back before Christmas, I was just over the hill and I had a snow pit that was only as deep as my knees and it was all facets. That's this snow still here today. So when we start out with winters where we have weak faceted snow everywhere, unless it just snows and snows and snows, we typically don't see it go away. And here we are in the middle, you know, uh, close to the middle of March and I still see that same weak snow down on the ground. All right, so moving forward, unfortunately up here at about 10,000 feet, the snow surface is slightly faceted. So I would imagine the new snow, especially with this storm coming up, is gonna fail easily up into this uh, old snow surface. I'm not really seeing a, a weak layer associated with this dust layer here. Um, we have seen avalanches fail down to about this dust layer. And then of course, if we see enough wind, enough water, I could see avalanches fail down into this depth or uh, down below. <laughs> 